A Course in Miracles, Lesson 196 It can be but myself I crucify. Before we continue with the theme, let us do the prayer from A Course in Miracles. I am here only to be truly helpful. I am here to represent Him who sent me. I do not have to worry about what to say or what to do because He who sent me will direct me. I am content to be wherever He wishes, knowing He goes there with me. I will be healed as I let Him teach me to heal. It can be, uh, but myself I crucify. Uh, throughout the central theme of the course has been that we are not different from others in the sense that we have come from the same source, the same love that is God. And uh, this is in a way, it's explaining to us that uh, what do you mean by crucify? Like when you blame someone, when you punish someone, when you get angry with someone, you know, it can be but myself I crucify. So unless and until that uh, uh, wrong that I see in another, another person because of which I'm blaming him, getting angry with him or punishing him, I can see something that is wrong with other only when that something wrong is in me. So when I crucify him, that is when I get angry, when I punish him, when I blame him, I am actually blaming myself. So it can be but myself I crucify. So very beautifully uh, Jesus goes about that when this is firmly understood and kept in full awareness, you will not attempt to harm yourself nor make your body slave to vengeance. You will not attack yourself and you will realize that to attack another is but to attack yourself. You will be free of the insane belief that to attack a brother saves yourself and you will understand his safety is your own and in his healing you are healed. So generally uh, when we attack someone uh, we uh, rather you know it creates a thought of vengeance and all these things but he is saying that it's an insane belief attacking anyone for anything be it a very grave crime or a small mistake but this sort of feeling of vengeance is an insane belief and we will be free if we understand this that it can be but myself I crucify we will be free from all these feelings Thus do you also teach your mind that you are not an ego, for the ways in which the ego will distort the truth will not deceive you longer. You will not believe you are a body to be crucified and you will see within today's idea the light of resurrection. Looking past all thoughts of crucifixion and of death to thoughts of liberation and, uh, and life. So this is the particular you know mantra it can be but myself I crucify that salvation song can certainly be heard in the idea we practice for today if it can be but you you crucify you did not hurt the world and need not fear its vengeance and pursuit and it's clearly explained that when we uh, crucify or when we get ang angry or when we promote vengeance or harmful thoughts we are always afraid that this attack this vengeance will come back to us so in a sense to be relieved from all that to, how can we be relieved from all that that instant wherein we realize actually our oneness so uh, again uh, there is no thought of God that does not go with you to help you reach that instant and to go beyond it quickly, surely and forever. When the fear of God is gone and there are no obstacles that still remain between you and the holy peace of God, how kind and merciful is the idea we practice. Give it welcome as you should for it is your release. It is indeed but you, your mind can try to crucify it, yet your redemption too will come with you. Even, you know, the very fear of God or something that we do wrong, all these are thoughts with which we actually crucify ourselves, not only attacking anyone, 
but even ourselves these things have to go and only with that holy instant wherein uh, the thought of god uh, there is no distance and in fact in one of the lessons towards the end there was a beautiful paragraph wherein jesus says that dream not of your brother's sinfulness but rather dream of all the good that he has done so these we have to encourage these thoughts you know to find the joy within to find when we see this goodness and this beauty in others we will realize that goodness and beauty in ourselves